Hey, what up guys? My name is Mailbox, and I'm pretty sure all of you know that the little preview trailer came out for Black Ops 2 Zombies a couple of days ago, uh, but if you haven't seen that already, I really recommend watching it before you watch this video. Uh, you can click the little annotation on the screen to watch my breakdown of it, uh, but based on that mini trailer, we know that there's this bus in Zombies that is obviously pretty important because the majority of the trailer is pretty much focusing on it. Uh, now, I mentioned in my other video that the bus driver is uh, pretty much our mystery man, you know? Uh, we really have no idea who he or she is is. Uh, we kind of see like their figure, their shadow in the trailer. Um, there's a lot of guessing going around. Some people think it's Richthofen because of the hat uh, that you can kind of see from this shot. Some people think it looks similar to Richthofen's hat from Black Ops 1. And a lot of people are predicting that it might be like a robot driving the bus uh, because of the voice that you hear right here. Welcome aboard! Okay, but now I'm going to show you guys something that you may have heard other YouTubers talk about. Maybe you just noticed it yourself, uh, but maybe you didn't notice it at all. Uh, there's a little fraction of a second at the end of the mini trailer um, when the bus is just passing by. And if you pause it just at the right time, uh, you can actually see this right here. Uh, this is actually the bus driver. Uh, now, you can tell because uh, you can see like the scrap metal nailed right next to the driver's window, uh, just like it was from this viewpoint right here. But I mean, just look at this. Jesus, this dude has no skin. He's completely bloody. Uh, but you can see the shape of the back of his head. And you can see the black and gold bus driver hat uh, with like the little golden stripe, you know. Uh, but think about this. You know, what kind of a live human can drive a bus with no skin on his face at all? Uh, this can't just be some regular human driving the bus. And to me, it doesn't really look like a robot. It could be, but to me, uh, so far, it doesn't really look like one. Um, it really just looks like a zombie. But how would that make any sense, you know? Um, a zombie zombie driving us away from other zombies, helping us out, uh, not eating us, you know, we don't know for sure, uh, we don't even really know that the bus driver is important at all, uh, but I just thought that this shot was pretty interesting. Now, I was thinking, you know, I was just thinking that maybe this has something to do with Samantha, uh, we know that she was once in control of the zombies and she knows a lot about them, uh, maybe it could be possible that she still knows of a way to control like one at a time, um, even though Richtofen is technically in control of all of them, uh, but maybe this zombie is still like following Sam instead of Richtofen, and uh, since Sam is on our side, he's helping us out. Um, a total guess here, but it just seems like it could be a pretty cool idea. Um, you know, like, like imagine this is true and Samantha doesn't have um, complete control of this zombie, you know, maybe just like partial control. Uh, what if at random times when we're on the bus, um, he just stops the bus, he turns around, and he goes after us, you know? Um, I don't know, it's just an idea, uh, but the main point of this video is to show you guys uh, what the bus driver looks like and that he doesn't look normal. So I really want to hear what you guys think about this, you know, tell me in the comments who you think this is or what you think this is. Um, if you think it's a zombie, you know, why do you think it's working for us? Um, I'll be reading through all of the comments and if you guys enjoyed this video, um, I'd really appreciate it if you smack the like button right in the face. Uh, no worries if you don't want to though, thanks for watching guys, I will see you next time, it has been LM.